have a look what we've got. Oh, Kate Blind. Now this is a dress I've seen at the Oscars. Oh really? It Just really now? is the, the shape that, and I've even seen it in wool. You know, it's a winter sort of idea. So it would be like a wool attached shawl. So it's very practical. But I've seen it in chiffon on the red carpets. You pick whether this one or <laughs> <laughs> I'll take this one. Election. All right, we can recreate the Oscar oh, dress. We can, super. Yeah. And it could be a strong pink or even a coral. It's such a lovely color, but could be scaparelli pink. Sounds good. Yeah. Mm. And then to complete the look, oh, love. So how is this gonna? We've got to try it's and get this. Now. Maybe we need it longer. Do you think so it goes actually? Yeah, this the is the whole the piece, unfortunately. <laughs> mm. But you can't open it, and no, that's well, it. Well, like isn't a square, it? actually. Yeah. Do you think? Well, well, I think we'll stick with it. But is it gonna lose anything by having it shorter at the back? Because it might end up just looking like a stole. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like a huge, a huge wall stole. That's probably better the shaping. Mm -hmm. Do you well, if we excuse that there's far too much fabric on it. Yeah, quite, <laughs> yeah, it's quite chunky, isn't it? It's definitely going to be nice and warm in July. Look how beautiful. Oh, without the cape. Without, without, without the, the cape. cape which... That would look nice on you. That would look gorgeous. Tippets they used to call them in the 40s, they usually made a mink, a mink tippet, a yes. little fur jacket, very short, with sleeve, or with even a cape, even if it was a cape shape, it was called the tippet. This is beautiful on the book frame actually. Yeah, I think so. On the so. dress it didn't suit, but for this? But, uh, it's the colour I think works so well, but uh, no, it's very, very important isn't it, that line. Yes. Divides the figure. Well, once mm. it's stitched, it would. Well, it could I be think almost it just a cashmere as well. Twice actually. twice at the back in the middle of the shoulder blade. Yeah. Just a lovely piece okay, of nice. cashmere. I think cashmere Natural would work very, very nicely with this. Our little red riding hood. Red, you love red? Yeah. You love red. Look, look. Very volunteer. Very volunteer. This time it's Givenchy. Oh, that, that of, um, actually, the dress on the Oscars was, was Valentino. So you know. Yeah, this is really nice. Yeah, we just have to hide the header. So this is right. This is not expensive. It's not. It's not inexpensive. Mm -hmm. Six hundred twenty-nine pound a meter. So half a meter will give you your cape. But yeah. <laughs> that's it. But when when we do shot at each, when you've got the cape as, as the base, or you could have this. Yeah. How'd you do this? One shoulder. <laughs> One shoulder sort of take a shot of that. Relaxed in a possibly. way, but at the same mm. time you're gonna have this as a. Well, it's like a leotard with an opening. It's wonderful. So she can walk. <laughs> she can dance if she wants to. She can do a lot of things. There we are. That's looking great. And, then and it's nice and summery. Easy. This works so much better than the red. Whoa. Yeah, yeah. Well, it was. Well, we, we are going for the evening gown or the workwear day for. A, an autumn winter feel you know on a colder day it's even more sort of a statement and you could pull it down so it sits just on the edge like 3d flower oh, yeah. and maybe lose it into the fold as if it is part of a cape mm. <laughs> just for a little bit oh wow yeah, it maybe looks 40 beautiful centimeters with gold. would be enough it, it really is special and simple, isn't it? And that's on top of the satin, so it gives it more depth. 
Then we'll put the other colour in. Things, you know. So you feel as if you're dressed and covered. Then she does the great reveal. <laughs> so this is the blue option. Blue or gold. And uh, we're going to do a close-up. Okay. Oscar, and it's smart casual work. Good work. Sherlock Holmes. So the smart casual <laughs> is definitely a coat. So what are we thinking? Country pursuits, lady farmers. Lady farmers. The young farmer. <laughs> Smart casual. Tweed and a wool. Herring bones wool and uh, just like a classic a. tweed, isn't it? it? It is a hunting tweed. Proper yeah. hunting tweed. Sometimes you can get form proof tweeds, which are very robust and you've got trousers walking through you know, bracken and all sorts oh, of forms right. that, that yes. protect your legs. Which is, that's super useful <laughs> in the country. It's quite far from a hunting season right now, isn't it? And yeah, the glorious 12, but that's right in the summer. And the hunting, the shooting, that, that's the sort of uh, grouse, I think. You get grouse beaters going on ahead, scaring them <laughs> into the air. It's all a little bit uh, very uh, 200 years ago, you know more. Not many people do the, uh, the grouse shoot. You know, these things. But this lady, she's probably walking her dog. <laughs> she probably is. <laughs> In Quite Baker Street. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Baker Street with Sherlock Holmes. That's his uh, station, 20, 20, isn't it? Uh, I think it was 21B. 21B Baker Street, which is now, I think, don't quote me it's actually a building society uh, office as in when it was abbey national yeah that's they used to answer the letters the fan mail for sherlock holmes oh really <laughs> it's like santa claus when you're in uh, in the north they were advertising that you can do fan mail uh, for uh, paddington bear as well yeah well, that, that's lovely and he would write you back and yeah the, the writer is very very generous yeah i love the a, film me too and I think they voted like the second Paddington is like one of the most popular films right now. It is, it was super, I was really impressed because I was expecting, you know, they'd just skim over, it wasn't for me to watch. I watched it and Paddington 2 is great, really good. So this is a very English summer look. Well, sort of <laughs> spring <summer>. autumn, <laughs> possibly spring autumn with the cape, though. but you know, you've got a very practical cooler day, sort of dress and uh, cover. Yeah.